Okay, Desert Bearhawk fans. It's late Sunday night, Thanksgiving weekend, 2013, and we are looking pretty good. All the pieces are in place, and we, as you can see, are ready to start riveting the right wing main spar together. All the rivets have been put in the holes. You can see them there. And there's a Coleco. Everywhere there's going to be a rib, there's a Coleco because we don't want to we don't want to put a rivet in these holes. So I'm using the Colecos as my markers. Some guys use bolts like a number six bolt and a nut. I'm using the Colecos because I have them. They're long reach Colecos so they work well. I've got all the vertical stiffeners in. Now the reason the rivets are in the holes are just to hold everything in position. Those rivets will come back out again once I do the double flush rivet here on each one of these. There will be a double flush rivet. And then, uh, then I will back drill my angles through these holes and then I'll rivet everything together. But as you can see, we are ready to go. Um, I did a couple practice rivets today on some scrap. Uh, my results were okay, I guess. Not really making me super happy and satisfied. But uh, tomorrow I'm going to go over to the airport. A buddy of mine's got an A-frame squeezer or an A-squeeze. It's supposed to be a 6,000-pound squeezer, so I'm going to be able to squeeze probably most of these rivets. And then the ones that I can't squeeze, we will look to buck very carefully. But there she is. She's ready to go. Oh, take note too that I also put Calicos in at the splice plate every place that I'm not supposed to put a rivet. Here's the row of rivets for the rib number 11. You can't put those rivets in yet. This one I can actually put a rivet here. I'm just using it as a hold to help hold it in position. So yeah, we're ready to go. So hopefully by tomorrow evening, we at least have some of the rivets driven on this. There's uh what 138, 276, 276 rivets I believe, just in the in the cap strips, and then there's another you know 20 over here. And uh, way down here at the splice, I think I counted 54 in the splice. So you're looking at uh, 300 plus rivets. So we'll see how it goes. Hopefully tomorrow i got a great update for you. Until then, we'll see you in the shop.